Hey, it's Tori, and welcome to, or welcome back to my channel. <gasps> Today we are going to be checking out some of my Toya. Now you guys did let me know in my crewist reaction that she had dropped a brand new single a couple of weeks ago. It is called Eye of the Storm. Now I don't know how I missed this or how I didn't realize she'd, she was bringing out new music but I absolutely cannot wait to hear this. So without further ado, let's just dive right in and check this song out together. I'm loving this music video, like just showing all of the past music videos she's put out and songs and she just improves every single time I listen to her. I love that she's being more experimental with her vocals and she's pushing herself and she's just that voice for me that is just super special and I really hope she tours over here soon whether that's next year or a couple of years I know she's doing she will be uh, back in England at the beginning of next year and if I could I would fly out because I know she's doing VIP meet and greets but I just I can't <laughs> I can't my husband and I are finally going on our honeymoon that we never took 10 years ago and we've finally been able to afford to go somewhere and do something that we have wanted to do so that's what we're saving up for right now if it wasn't for that then yeah I'd be on a plane I think in February she will be in Manchester if I'm not mistaken and yeah if I ever got to meet Toya I think she's just that person for me that would made me cry <laughs> like I try not to put people on pedestals but she is the voice that got me into symphonic rock and symphonic metal and and this type of music and has been that voice that has guided me throughout my teen years and into adulthood and, and all of that so I mean I'm sure there's people out there who understand what I'm saying but yeah I am loving this
I really loved that, that instrumental section we just got right there. I loved the switch up between like the classical side and then we got the guitar and then it brought it back to classical, then guitar, and then went into that other piece. This is so fun. So fun. December 2nd, her new album comes out. She got me there right at the end. It's when she really soars up into those high notes and she really lets go that just her voice shines for me. And she just, she just has that voice that just really speaks to my soul. And I really hope one day I get to see her live because, you know, I did discover her when she was with Nightwish, obviously, but I literally discovered them 2004 and then everything happened in 2005 and then she went on to do her solo stuff and I've always kept up with her solo things and I'm so glad that I have this channel now because I get you guys giving me reminders and I love you for that because being a reactor it's hard you got to try and stay on top of everything and you sometimes miss things or you just don't see it and I do follow her on her social media so I will try and keep a closer eye on that but yeah I just she is a bucket list artist for me absolutely I told my husband if she does come here because I know she only tours like select few states so if she goes to New York or somewhere else then we're gonna have to fly there we're gonna have to I I need to see her before I mean I doubt she's gonna retire anytime soon but you know you just never know and yeah I need to hear that voice in person I need to feel those emotions and like I say I try not to put, put people on pedestals but she she just brings so much nostalgia and, and her voice has shaped who I am musically as a person so yeah. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe to become a Torian. Speak of becoming a Torian, all of my social media links and my Discord link are down in the description. We'd absolutely love for you to come hang out in the Discord community and I will see you guys in the next video. Rock on!